Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Uh, I am somewhere in the great state of West Virginia. So anybody out there that's a mountaineer, let me know down below uh, in the comments. You know, I'm on a long drive. I got a big journey ahead of me. Uh, I'll give you more insight into that as we uh, roll along and uh, I'll keep making content for you. Just pulled over, uh, had about two and a half hours in and you know, I love this about long drives. It really gives you a time to think. And of course, I'm thinking about crypto. And there's one particular crypto that I don't own right now that I need to really consider owning. And I used to own this crypto back in 2021 and made a little bit of a profit on it, didn't think anything of it, understood that it was a good project, that it's been around a while, that it has a lot of uh, whale activity. People really see the value in this particular project, but I've kind of abandoned it over the last several months. And uh, again, these long drives really help you kind of uh, think, right? Sometimes I like just driving with no sound at all. I do like podcasts from time to time as well, but I'm driving down the highway early this morning, no sounds, just me and my thoughts. And uh, again, I was thinking about crypto and this is the one that came into my head and it's Chainlink. So Link uh, is of course a top crypto that's been around a while and it is the top crypto when we come to oracles, right? And allowing smart contracts to be built very easily and uh, interact with other smart contracts. So I'm looking at Chainlink and the price has been completely decimated like a lot of the top projects out there. And uh, I remember reading just a couple days ago about Link and what's been happening here over the past several months, and really since we've hit this big bear market in 2022, and big time whales are accumulating Chainlink right now at rapid, rapid rates. If you remember, Chainlink was up over $50 last bull run, uh, now getting Chainlink around five, six, seven dollars just to me is an absolute steal. And it's tough, right? Because there's so many cryptos out there that you wanna to add to your portfolio. I already own 29 of the top 100. And then, oh yeah, I'm trying to diversify a little bit, get into the stock market. I'm always trying to find a way to diversify, but still have it fit into the longer term plan, the longer term goal uh, with my investment strategy and where I wanna be 20 years from now. I'm 32 years old uh, and I started pretty late investing, to be honest with you. So I'm trying to make up for lost time. Uh, and, you know, it's never too late to start though. So if you're watching this and you're a little bit older than I am and you haven't started yet, uh, it's not too late. It's never too late. And uh, I'm looking at it the same way when I look at Chainlink. It's not too late to invest. In fact, again, it's the best time. It's the best time. This is where the most returns will happen. And I'm looking at the top projects and where do I, where do I, where did I miss the mark in 2021? Where did I miss the mark? And how could I better prepare myself for the next time this market comes back, making sure I have a piece of a lot of these top projects. So Chainlink is definitely one. Once I get uh, where I'm going here today, look at the price a little bit, analyze it before I decide to you know find my entry point. And I'm definitely going to be adding this to the portfolio. Let me know what you guys think about Chainlink down below. By the way, they've partnered with a ton of other crypto companies. I really look at Chainlink, last thing before we go, I really look at Chainlink as kind of the glue in the crypto industry. So many different projects utilize its technology. And because of that, I don't think it's going away. I don't think it's going away anytime soon. And you can't say that for all crypto projects, right? But when it has a unique utility like Chainlink does, I want a piece of that action and I'm gonna find a way to get some. That's what I've got for you guys. Let me know what you think about it down below. Don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe and uh, give me your thoughts on link down below. We'll see you in the next video.